So the last thing that I want to wear in summer is <laughs> anything, but some of us have to make our winter wardrobes work into summer. Amanda G wrote in on email asking me how she can do just that. So here are some tips and tricks. And voila, here is our first outfit of transitioning winter clothes into summer. As long as the color translates, why not wear your V and crew neck sweaters with a pair of silk shorts? This is a great reason to be buying easy year-round colors like ivory black, gray, pastels work awesome. And I also paired it with an awesome riding boot. You want to keep your sleeves rolled up so that your arms can breathe. All you have to do is put a band on your wrist. I used a hair tie here so that it matched my fabric and fold the fabric into it just a little bit at the wrist, then squish it up past your elbow and voila, you have Instacool, totally looks J. Crew, and it won't slip down or stretch out your fabric. And if it gets too hot, just pop your sweater over your shoulders with a cute lace trimmed cami. There's no reason your boots should be collecting dust in your closet this summer. Pop your riding or motorcycle boot with cutoffs and pair it with a bag that transcends season, like this gorgeous orange from Marc Jacobs. I also paired this look with a silk blouse that kind of gives a nice flowy femme silky touch and this necklace from Fallon. Ah, oh, isn't that so amazing? I love the bling. Now the shorts are from Paige and super comfortable and I think they'll work fabulously into fall. One key piece I can't live without, and maybe it's because I was raised in the 90s, is a flannel. It's absolutely adorable, paired with a more tailored short, like these from Rag & Bone. I also put an Enza Costa v-neck, very flowy top underneath it to contrast the plaid with the stripes, and I also love the option of tying it around your waist if you get a little warm. Pair it with an ankle boot and you are all set to wear that flannel in summer. Amanda, thank you so much for your question. I hope these were helpful hints and suggestions. And I love hearing from you, so please keep the questions coming. Leave them in the comments below. Tell me what you thought about this video. Don't forget to hit thumbs up and come back next week for more. I'll see you guys next time. Smooches.